right, so we're going to ask you guys just a couple of questions about flipped learning and Miss Roach's class. If you could um, help us out with your perspective, that would be great. What have you liked best about the flipped classroom? I'd have to say I liked best, like, we can rewind it anytime we want, like, because other kids, like, they learn at a slower pace sometimes or a faster mm -hmm. pace, and me having my own pace is, like, really helpful. Um, I think probably the same thing as Taylor. I can rewind it, replay it. I like it because when teachers are in front of my lecturing, like some kids fall asleep and then they miss like information, but if it's a video, you can watch it anytime you want. I'd say definitely just being able to kind of go at your own pace, just because some kids, like sometimes for them, it might be it might take them a bit longer to kind of understand some things, and then other people, you can like get the notes faster, you get it quicker than them. And so you don't have to worry about other kids like asking questions or asking to go back to slides and that kind of thing. I like that it doesn't give you like homework like the other classes do. It you just take notes at home and then it's pretty much you're done. <clears throat> what I like from a uh, from an athlete's point of view, being able to watch the videos um, on your own time. So if you have practice and stuff and you gotta like cram in homework. You can watch you can watch the videos like on the bus. Um, really, you can watch them like anywhere, so it's really helpful. I like having the opportunity to have time in class for activities, and then at home we get to learn all the information. I like having the videos there constantly on the internet. So even if you're falling behind or you don't know, or you're kind of forgetting about a certain part, you can watch the videos all over again. Um, I like that you can go back and like review it and yeah. <laughs> uh, I like the, the visual that you can see it. Okay. You know, uh, I like a little bit of both of what they said, how you can go back and re-get the notes that you left out before the first time you watch it so you can re-watch it and, and plus it, you, she gives you pictures that you can look at and she'll sometimes have the notes on the screen so you The flexibility, the ability to just pause it in the middle and rewind when you need to. Okay. I agree. Being able to stop and go back and fast forward. And go at your own pace. Nice. Yeah. What I've liked most is that I can learn on my own schedule. The fact that you can work like at your own pace and everything. Like with the videos, you pause it, go back and like read exactly what it says, like pay attention to the small details. What is the most helpful part of the flipped classroom? Probably to yeah, go back in. Because you can also constantly revise it, so if you're studying for a test, you can go and rewatch the videos if you have to. Okay. It's like your own responsibility to watch it. If you don't watch it, it's your fault. Um, I get distracted in class whenever people are playing with their pen or something like that, so I think that it's better watching it at home so I'm in a quiet environment. I can listen to it and focus. Yeah, I agree with them. We can, it's our responsibility, and then if we don't do it, then we can't blame the teacher because we didn't watch the video. Definitely, though, being able to pause and rewind, that's the most useful thing. I agree. Yeah. Okay. The most helpful part is watching the videos and being able to pause or rewind if you missed any um, information or didn't understand it. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, that you can kind of just do it when you have time. So yeah. I can control my pace, like I can pause the video when I might not get something. And it's easy to get to from wherever you're at, from Internet Explorer to Google Chrome. The the play pause button because I, I can stop, I can rewind, if I didn't catch something I just play it back. Mm -hmm. I have to agree with that, the play and stop button, it helps us a lot. We work at our own, own pace basically. How confident do you feel about the material after watching the videos before coming to class? I'd say pretty confident, but with like a few questions. Yeah, yeah there's usually just minor details that you have to ask questions about in class. I agree with them. Um, I don't feel as confident. Like I have a lot of questions that are unanswered and watching the video over again, I just feel better having like a teacher's perspective on answering my questions. When I watch the videos at like nighttime, like before I go to bed, 
I don't really get it in the morning before the test, so then I'll watch it before class because I have a study block and it uh -huh. helps a lot. Sometimes when I watch it after, I don't get it, so I have to rewatch it over and over. Before coming into class, I feel somewhat confident. I still have a few questions for Miss Roach. And yeah, I'm most of the time I'll have some areas that are kind of blurry, but once we come into class, it'll get figured out. Um, I feel like okay, like I know a good amount to get me to like started on everything. Pretty confident. Yeah, I would say pretty confident too before I come to class. I feel somewhat confident. Um, I feel pretty confident in stuff I've learned. Um, I feel confident enough to pass a quiz in the next class. I feel kind of confident, but after like, I get into class and do whatever activity Ms. Roach gives us, I feel a little bit more confident. How confident do you feel about the material after watching the video and then after coming to class? I feel very confident. Like I get the whole subject. It depends on the subject, or not the subject, the, uh, what we're learning, like the content, but most of the time I understand it. Yeah, I understand it too, and then if I have questions, I just ask Ms. Roach and she'll explain it to me. I'm much more confident. I usually feel like I completely understand the subject. I think it's kind of the same, because you get to ask questions through, um, through the video, and also if you have extra questions, you write on the side of your notes, and then you can ask the teacher when you get to class, and it helps a lot. After watching the videos in class, or like after talking about them in class and doing activities that help us learn more about what we learn in the videos, I definitely feel more confident. I agree. Okay. I feel really confident after. Well, after class I kind of forget some of it, but I feel like if we did another test I'd remember it again. Right. And you could always watch that video again too, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, and I feel very confident after class because I got all my work done and I have more have more things in my brain that I have learned from, from the video and from her teaching. I feel very confident. I feel as though I have a greater understanding of what's going on. Kind of. <laughs> it's more confusing after class sometimes. Okay. Extremely confident. Yeah, I agree. Extremely confident about it.